With every 1984 delivery, the Cadillac Motor Car Division reconfirmed its dedication to a new way of doing business. The Gold Key Delivery System was created to set Cadillac owners apart in an automotive world that is fast becoming ordinary. Cadillac and its owners have always been and always will be special. The delivery of a new Cadillac must be unlike the delivery of any other car. It is a Cadillac and belongs to the Cadillac owner. It is our intent to keep this feeling alive. Any system is only as good as those who make it work. But change often meets resistance and the Gold Key delivery system is no exception. In April 1984, research conducted by an outside firm at Cadillac's request evaluated the acceptance of the Gold Key delivery system by retail dealer sales and service personnel. Consumer response was also measured. The result of this research confirmed that the Gold Key delivery system, when carried out as designed, impacted the owner body by increasing both overall satisfaction and owner loyalty. The survey results also pointed to the fact that in some cases, the Gold Key delivery system was not being totally embraced or administered by retail personnel. To share the findings of this research, a sampling of Cadillac retail dealer sales and service personnel were invited to a television studio in Detroit, Michigan, to participate in a discussion concerning their views about the 1984 Gold Key delivery system. Participants were Greg Wuerl, service director, Ralph Haas, sales manager, Walter Burbella, service director, Pete Hoon, sales consultant. The following ad-libbed tape excerpts are from that discussion and were prompted by the participants' actual remarks in response to the original research interviews. To present some differing viewpoints, a professional actor plays the part of Mr. Jones. Although his comments are scripted, they reflect actual comments from Cadillac retail sales and service personnel interviewed during the research phase of this project. The moderator, Mr. Chris Bone, is also a professional actor. Yeah, I've heard all this before. I'm so telling you, Gold Key Delivery System? This isn't Can new. Get much information I'm not buying it. This? Oh, so this must be show business. That's it. Who are you, Phil Donahue? <laughs> Hi, how are you? All right. You guys must be the stars of the show. More or less, yeah. I don't know why they asked me to be on this panel, because I certainly have a couple of things to say about Gold Key, but I don't know if you want to hear them. Well, I'm sure you have something to say, but what makes you think that we don't want to hear it? Don't be concerned with what I think. It's what I know that counts, about Cadillac and all that time-wasting Gold Key delivery system. <laughs> I've been around this business a long time, long enough to know that time is money. Now, I hate wasting time because it's inefficient. Hey, if you're having a problem, tell us about it. That's what we're here for, to talk about it. Mr. Jones. Jones. And the gold key is your problem, not mine. It isn't worth the effort, believe me. What do you mean it's not worth the effort? Now, don't get me wrong. I mean, the gold keys are really a nice touch, real class. The customers like them, especially that full tank of fuel. But the rest of it, hey, just takes too much time. I don't know about you, but I'm a busy man, and I don't have time for all this, so I've written some of these points down here. I've already covered time, hey, right? Hey, whoa, so whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Got a whole list there. Wait a minute. You're entitled to your own opinion, but uh, let's cover these items one at a time. The first item on your list, you say the gold key delivery system takes too much time, right? That's right. Too much time right, wasted on customers. Service managers don't have time to talk to every customer who buys a new car. And as far as salesmen are concerned, they should be out there selling, not driving around the countryside with customers. All right, all right. Time is the first problem. Let's see what the others have to say about it. Walt, you, for example. In your dealership, do you find that the Gold Key delivery system takes too much time? Yeah, it takes a couple minutes. Our sales personnel will introduce the customer to either me or my service advisors. This way they feel very comfortable when they do come in for service. Yeah, I think comfortable probably is a very important aspect. If I were a, a customer uh, buying a new car, I'd certainly want to meet the people that are going to take care of me, you know, after the selling process. Uh, I'd also, I think, because I'd met them pre previously, I'd have a lot more confidence in them. Uh -huh. And it is a large investment for some of these people, and they do deserve to be treated special. And it just doesn't take all that much time. Well, that's the consensus. It doesn't take much time, and it is worth the effort. <laughs> maybe, yeah, maybe no. That's not the biggest part of it. 
What about the extra time salespeople are supposed to take? You can't tell me that's efficient. Well, let's see how we'd handle that one. Browse. I think it's time well spent. It gives the salesman a chance to get a better acquainted with his customer. It also gives him an opportunity to demonstrate the features of the car on the way to the service station for the fill up and gets the customer off to a much better salesman-customer relationship. He feels like he's really getting his money's worth when he gets starts off with a full tank of gas. Well, that's all very well, if the salespeople have the time to give. But don't count on it, especially in a high-volume dealership. You can't afford to have people off the floor for an hour at a time to deliver cars. Can anyone afford the time it takes to take care of problems later on when customers come back because they don't understand something? Ah, it doesn't happen very often. Yeah, but it does happen, doesn't it? And what's more, who can afford the extra time it takes to sell a first-time customer if you lose a regular repeat customer because he wasn't treated right? That's the reason behind the Gold Key delivery system, to make sure that the first impression customers get is good enough to make a real difference in their level of satisfaction. So they'll keep coming back. It makes them feel like they've been singled out for special attention. It's important to take the time to make sure they understand everything about their new Cadillac before they drive away from the dealership. And if they don't, it's just going to create problems for both your sales and your service people later on. But that's only part of it. Pete, you're a sales consultant. Help me out. For the person who pays $20,000 and up for an automobile, at that time, it's a very exciting time. It's a very exciting time for us. And uh, we'd like to keep that excitement in the sale, and it does... Uh, make it much smoother for the future. Thank you, Pete, but let me ask you one thing. Do you really need an hour to do a good job? Yes, I think you need at least an hour to do a good job. There's a lot of new equipment on these cars, a lot of new options on these cars that need to be fully explained to the customer uh, for them to be fully satisfied when they uh, drive off the lot. And a satisfied customer is a repeat customer. Good point. Well, these people seem to be saying that the time it takes for Gold Key is a good idea. How do you feel about it now? Well, I certainly agree with the theory. It's important to give customers your full attention when they take delivery of a new Cadillac. But I still say it takes too much time. There's too much overlap. What do you mean? Based on my experience, we give customers a thorough demonstration drive when they buy the car. Why do it all over again a month later when they come in to pick it up? And if you do the new vehicle inspection right, why do a pre-delivery inspection later on? It's like doing the same job twice, and that's not efficient. You know, I suspect our panel here will have some answers for those questions, too. Why don't we discuss it? Hey, come on. Let's not waste any more time than we have to. I'm a busy man, you know? Now, now, wait a minute. You're talking about overlap. Why give the customer a test drive during delivery when you gave him a demonstration drive a month earlier during the sale, right? Okay, anyone have an answer for that? Yeah, I think that you're going to you're going to forget a lot of features on the automobile in, in a 30-day period from the time you ordered it until the time you're going to drive it away. Uh, and plus, it's it's also good to, before you take the delivery delivery of the car at that time to go over everything again with the salesman. Uh, we had an instance which occurred in our dealership several years ago uh, with a digital speedometer uh, cluster that had a metric English conversion lever. And uh, the salesmen weren't explaining what that lever was for, and, and people would in, inadvertently push it over to metric, and it would read metric numerals, and they thought there was something wrong. So we developed a lot of customer inconvenience because they'd bring the car in for repairs when it really wasn't necessary if it had been explained to them properly the first time. So this is what the gold key system has done in, in improving and, uh, on that and not allowing these things to occur any longer. Does that answer your question? Well, partly. Customers do forget, especially options new to them. That's why a test ride is so important. So we will have no dissatisfied customers. I understand that, but that's only half of my question. I was referring to the overlap between new vehicle d inspection and pre-delivery inspection. Well, we do a lot of the pre-delivery inspection and the new vehicle inspection at the same time. Uh, when we receive a car, we, you know, we go over it, we put the wheel discs on the car, we, 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 we clean, we polish the car. Uh, you know, and the car is basically a ready car, ready to be sold, uh, excluding the final uh, second, you know, inspection due at the time of delivery. Uh, I think that makes for a more efficient uh, way of doing business, and you're the, the, the expert on efficiency apparently today. Well, you mean you do everything as soon as you receive it? Why? Well, I think that when you were coming, if you were coming into our store to buy a new car, you, you would want to want to look at, a, at a, a clean, finished product rather than to look with something with road grime all over it from a truck and, and plastic in the interior. I think that a clean product and a finished product uh, tends to allow a dealer to sell more cars. It sounds pretty efficient. 
Yeah, it is efficient. I, I'd say that, that our sales are probably uh, up a little bit because of the way we do that. And I think that, uh, uh, again, you know, people just tend to perceive the car as, as, a, as a good looking car as opposed to something that's an unfinished product. Of course, you're in a high volume situation. I imagine you turn your inventory over pretty fast. I wonder if your method would work in a dealership with less volume. Ralph, what's your opinion? Basically, we use the same system. We service the cars as they arrive. We also perform the pre-delivery inspection, the same as the gold key delivery suggests. We find by doing that that we pick up a lot of the little items that seem to happen to a car when it sits on the lot for a week or two. And by taking care of them before the customer discovers them, we save him a trip back and save ourselves a lot of time in the shop. Well, how are we doing? Beginning to see things a little differently? Well, okay, they made some good points, but that's only part of the picture. So what else do you have on your list? Well, while we're on the same subject of new vehicle and pre-delivery inspections, there's a the problem of the inspection form itself. It's too big, too complex, and it slows the whole process down. It's not a... I know it's not efficient. And I think you might get some disagreement on that, too. Well, yeah, I disagree. Our customers are very impressed with the form. Our salesmen go over it with the customer and show them everything we've checked everything we've repaired before they take delivery of the car. In a sense, you're merchandising your new vehicle and pre-delivery inspections to your customers. Yes, it makes our customers feel very good, take care of all the problems in advance so they don't have to come back. The customer, when he gets the form, has four signatures on it. Now that's impressive. It certainly shows that we're trying to give them a trouble-free car. All right, all right, those are all good points, but let me see how you answer this one. Shoot. The rules say that you're supposed to take the customer to a service station to fill up the tank. Now, I know it's supposed to have some kind of psychological effect on the customer, underscoring the fact that we're giving him a tank of fuel. But I don't think most customers want to take the time. They'd say, why didn't you do that before I got here? Now, that's a valid point, don't you think? Frankly, I don't, but let's see what our panel has to say. Greg? Well, that could be a valid point. Uh, we, we fuel all our cars as we get them in. Uh, during new vehicle inspection. However, at the time of delivery with the customer in the car, our salesman will, will take the owner by our gas pump, which is at our facility, and just kind of top it off to show them we're going that one bit step further to institute a little more customer satisfaction. I finally thought I got someone to agree with me. Well, we feel that it's a, a big advantage from the salesman standpoint to make the trip to the service station with the customer and give the impression that he is doing this for the customer. It creates a little better relationship starting out, and people don't feel like the salesman's forgotten them as soon as he finished the deal. Well, looks as if we have a disagreement here now. Which one of you is right? <laughs> well, I say we feel that there is an advantage in doing it. It's not absolutely essential that they do it, but it does give them that excuse to spend a little more time with the customer to point out the features, the things that he's not familiar with, make sure that he does understand the operation of the vehicle, and Consequently, if he understands the operation of it, he's going to get a lot more satisfaction out of it. Good point, Ralph. I agree. It's good to have the customer present if the customer has time, but a full fuel tank is the most important part. The full fuel tank is one of the two things our customers are most impressed with. What's the other one? Thousand mile inspection. The thousand mile inspection. That's another thing on my list. <laughs> the thousand mile inspection. What's wrong with that? Well, of course, there's some good things about it. For one thing, there's the money we get for doing it. But it's inconvenient to customers to come back that soon. They feel the longer they can stay away from the service department, the better. And anyway, they're used to longer intervals. And besides, we don't have the staff to handle all those people coming back for their inspections. And on top of that, they all expect to get a free oil change. You do have an awfully negative approach to things, don't you? Why can't you look at it from a positive point of view? Come on, anybody. Well, most customers really take advantage of that 1,000-mile inspection. They feel like they're getting extra care. It's something a little additional. We take a full hour on the job. And we even have customers some who like to stand and watch the job done. I think it gives, it gives the customer an opportunity to come in on a positive note. Uh, normally, when, a, when an owner brings a car in, it's because he has a problem. Thousand mile inspection, normally he doesn't have a problem. He's getting a service for free, and he takes advantage of it. He has a positive attitude about the service department. But don't you find it difficult to sell them on the oil change? I mean, most customers expect to get it for free. Hey, wait a minute. Are they supposed to get an oil change at 1,000 miles? No, no, not at all. I didn't think so. You're just trying to be efficient again, aren't you? 
combining two steps in one. Well, why not? Efficiency is the name of the game, isn't it? And this program just isn't efficient. Hey, look. We've talked about the time it takes to do a gold key delivery, and our friends here say it is worth the time. We've talked about introducing the customer to the service manager, about taking the customer to the service station for the fill-up, the inspection form, the new vehicle prep and the pre-delivery inspection process, and the thousand-mile inspection. And we haven't even mentioned the owner's portfolio, the audio cassette, or the gold key identification card, but they're all parts of the system, too. Now, these people, all of them, from very successful Cadillac dealerships, have said that every step in the process is important, and they have a valid reason for being part of the overall program. Now, come on. Haven't they convinced you even a little bit? I have to admit that they've made some very good points. Everything they've said makes sense. At least it makes sense in theory. But where's the proof? Where are the results? Most customers don't even know that there's such a thing as a, as a gold key delivery system. Oh, they're aware that the gold keys are new, and they're pleased with the tank of fuel. But other than that, it's nothing special to them. And just show me how this does anybody any good. Customers today say that the cars are coming through better than ever. They're getting a lot more for their money. I give some of the credit to the factory. However, it's the gold key delivery system that makes the cars what they are. And these people will certainly come back to buy another car. I don't really care if they're aware of the system as such. We want them satisfied. And we want them to return, and with this gold key system, I think they will. Well, it, it gives us a chance to get, uh, get a lot closer to our customer, uh, every one of them. We give them a little special attention. You know, it shows that we care, and it also shows something that we haven't had in a long time. It shows that the factory really cares about the owner. Uh, they're they're going to be in for service uh, for more years because they're happier with the facilities, and we are seeing a lot fewer complaints. You get only one chance for a first impression. Gold key makes the first impression that will last a long time. I agree. It'll mean more repeat business in the long term. More referrals, too. But how do you know? I'd believe what you're saying if just one Cadillac customer I'd ever met said anything that would support what you're saying. Have you ever asked? Well, no. I mean, not specifically. After all, hey, I've had Cadillac in my blood from the day I was born. But I want yeah, to tell Yeah, I know. I know. You're a very busy man. Well, we have talked to customers. And here's what they say. Yes, I felt the ex explanation we received for the um, Gold Key system really let us know exactly what the extras were and how they worked and how we would use them. It, it was a comfortable situation when we drove away. We didn't feel that something was going to pop on and we wouldn't know how to handle it. We really felt that she covered everything very well for us. When you open the book up, well, before you open it up, with the leather book and everything, when they, they hand that to you, you know you're, you're going first class. And I think the, the thousand mile check is an excellent idea because by that point in time the owners had a chance to have the car say roughly three or four weeks they know if there's a problem with anything and instead of waiting six thousand miles twelve thousand miles what have you it gets caught early in the program so i would say that's one of the more worthwhile parts of the system i was pleased that i got a full tank because i didn't expect it he purchased cars before and uh, i never heard of anybody receiving full tank with the car People, I would say of everything, have noticed the keys more than anything else, you know, of course, other than the car. As soon as we picked up the car from the dealer, we put the tape on and we just listened to it. It was great. I think that the um, feeling you get of personal service is something that's been lacking for a long time. And you don't feel like you're just somebody who came in, signed a paper, and you're gone. You really feel like they care enough to explain how to use the product and tell you that if anything goes wrong, they'll be happy to take care of it. You feel good about it. You really feel good about driving the car. I fill out a list for my salesman of about four or five people that he's already contacted from just my dealing with them. And uh, he sold a couple of to friends of mine and have a couple of more deals at hand now on new Cadillacs. Uh, what sold me basically on this particular dealership was the salesman. Uh, he did an excellent job as far as selling the car, and he's done an even better job as far as after the sales service, which to me is the ultimate measure of a salesman and a dealership. As you know that we are restaurant owners and we do know a lot of people, we get to talk to a lot of people. I've told just about everybody, and they just think it's great. 
and I introduced them to a few guys that had had very bad experiences in the past, and they had all bought either Cadillacs or some form of a luxury car. And uh, they gave really gave him basically a very difficult time, and he handled it quite well. And uh, to make a long story short, two of these people have bought cars from him in the last two weeks, just based on that meeting. So not only did it benefit me to have this what you call a go-car delivery system, but it also benefited the dealer because due to the system, he generated two sales that normally would have never had. Several of our neighbors had asked how we liked the dealership and the salespeople and the car itself, of course, and we've been happy to tell them because it really made you feel very special. Well? Well, when you look at it that way, I guess I just didn't realize people felt that way about it. All right, how do you feel about the gold key delivery system now? Well, maybe there's more to it than I thought. How's that? Because I can see now that it's a pretty efficient system after all. A few small steps right at the start can generate all that loyalty for years, and that's my definition of efficiency. I guess it's time to give the system a fair try. Hey, wait a minute. Yes? Look, I'm glad you're feeling so positive about Gold Key, but how would you like to prove it? Hey, give me some time. No, 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 no. I mean right now. Let's continue this discussion. Okay, but on one condition. What's that? I don't want to do a rehearsal. I want to do the real thing right now. Now, I mean it. I got on my good clothes. I got the lights here. This is my good side right here. You want to zoom in on me? I got a plane to catch. I'm a busy man. Let's do it now. You guys know your lines? I hope so. The gold key delivery system is working. As its acceptance and use continues, it will be more than a new way to do business for Cadillac. It will become the only way. And it will continue to be refined. For example, for 1985, one complete package of gold key materials will be shipped with each vehicle from the assembly plants. The portfolio and owner literature have been redesigned and the materials upgraded for a simplified and more professional presentation. Individual cassette tapes for each car line will be included to personalize the new owner's introduction of the product. And the 1985 model's gold keys have been given a protective coating to preserve their jewelry-like finish. These and other improvements still under study are the result of ideas and suggestions received from people who sell and service our products at the retail dealer level. To make the gold key delivery system thrive takes both your belief in its effectiveness and your suggestions for improvement. Please accept this invitation to become involved, to take an active part in our new and only way of doing business, the Cadillac way.